Hey, what is going on guys, Bridge Fusion here, and today I'm with you for another video, and today's video is an unboxing of a digital camera that I bought off of Amazon, and it was £99, but was it worth it? I really, really, for my sake, hope that it was worth it. So we do have the box right here. It's not like branded or anything. So this isn't also a like a sponsorship video. So whatever I say about this product is my honest opinion. Apparently it can go to like 4K on that one and there's all the other features that does come with the camera. The main reason I wanted to get this camera, I don't know if it shows it on the box. I know it doesn't, but the camera like flips out so I can do like, if it's really that good, I can do like vlogging and see myself, which is absolutely awesome. So yes, let's waste no more time and get into this one. There's going to be no like little cut on my usual like unboxing videos because it is going to literally be a little bit like that. So that's what it looks like on the inside of the box. So you do get a screen cleaner just right there. And then you do get a instruction manual. Um, let's have a little look. Is there anything I need to know? It's a camera. <laughs> it's a camera. I know that it's basic needs, basically. So, yeah, it does come with two white boxes. So, it comes with that one. That one feels quite heavy. So, I believe that might be the camera itself. And then, yeah, this does say accessories on this one. So, let's get rid of that one. Boom. Just like that. So, yeah, let's open the accessories box first. So, oh, so it does come with a strap for the camera which is absolutely awesome and then we do have a hdmi lead don't know why you'd need a hdmi lead on that one and it does come with two batteries just like so for the camera itself and then it does come with a charging wire so i believe you've got to put the batteries in the camera to actually charge it and then it does come with a safety lens for the camera as well. So now we don't need that one at the moment. Let's put all that there and let's look at this one itself. So it's a little bit heavier than I thought it was. And oh, it actually comes in a little gray bag just like this. So it's a drawstring bag. So, oh, there's the camera and boom, here it is. Here is the camera on here. It's, I'm literally only being able to call it a camera, like an Amazon camera maybe. And like I said, with the flip, boom, just like that. So it does like have the flip out so you can put like a uh, like load of like so you can do the vlog. Basically, that's what I was trying to say. So loads of thing was go going through my head because over here we do have an area where you can add a microphone on there because that can go up here as well. A USB right there, I believe that's to charge it. And it says here HD, but I'm not sure what the HD would mean. I don't know if that would mean like you can put a like a light up here maybe because that is there. So let's waste no more time and turning this one on. So we are going to do a little test. I'm going to... Why, why is it not? It's not working because I haven't got the battery in it. What an absolute plonker I am. So let's get that one out. And I believe the battery goes in here. It does come with an SD card that is already inside there. So let's, how do you do this? There we are. Clipped in and boom, done. So let's, how do you turn this on? Up here. So let's turn this one on. So it says welcome on there. And then there is the screen for the camera. And it's not actually too bad. It's not too bad on that one. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take a photo of this area. Let's, let's I've got some Jaff cakes in front. So let's put the Jaff cakes right front center. And let's take a photo of that. So which one's that one? It's right there. Okay, so that is that one. And then if we go to mode, we're on camera mode right now. So that's what the screen looks like for camera mode. It's quite hard to show, but in a minute, I'll put it on my computer and we'll have a little test run of how it looks. So what I'm going to do 
for this one. Wait a minute. Is there... So say if I go to menu and then video. Oh, so you do get to choose what kind of like like a uh, resolution that you want. So you can go to 4K. I might go straight to 4K because that might be like the actually the best one for this one, obviously because it's 4K, but because it's a cheaper kind of camera. Uh, just wanted to make sure that I do get the best out of this one. So I'm going to do a little vlog right now. Well, it's about going to be 10 seconds. And then I'll show you what it looks like. So let's do it. Hey, what is going on guys? Bridge Fusion here. And today I'm with you for a little tester to see how this is. So yeah, that is that part. Let's skip to the computer to see how it is. I am really sorry, I did accidentally delete the footage, but here's the photo of the Jaffa Cakes that I took. Let's get straight back. It's not great. I think if I go through the settings properly on my own, um, hopefully I'll better make it good enough for a little video. Wait, give me a minute. Hey, what is going on guys? Bridge Fusion here and today I'm with you for another video and today's video is a little test vlog. So I've done the recording again and I think it's turned out a little bit better to be honest. I do feel I do need to get like a little microphone for it because the audio isn't great if I'm honest. But even though it says 4K, it is awful in 4K. I don't know if I've managed to save the video or not to show you guys. But that is definitely a lot better than it was before. So I'm going to, when I go on a vlog again, like do a little trip somewhere, I will take it with me and I will like test it out just to see how it goes. And I want to try and do some stuff outside to see how that goes. But hopefully if I can get the settings correct, it will be okay. So, yeah, I would love to know what you guys think. Do you think it's the way forward? Do you think I just should stick with my phone? The only reason I don't want to stick with my phone is literally because of the battery life. Like, it drains so much battery. I do have, a, like, a portable charger, but I would prefer to try and stick with a camera. Like, obviously, I won't use this my whole life. It's just going to be, like, a temperamental thing until I get in the dollar. <laughs> but, anyway... I would love to know what you guys think down in the comment section below. If I'm honest, at the moment, it's a good starter for a camera. Like, if you're just starting out vlogging, I know I've been doing it for about three or four years now. But I'm now trying to move to camera. And I think it's probably a good place to start. But yeah, let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below. I will love to see them. And yeah, once again, I've been Bridge Fusion. I really do hope you like this video. Leave a comment and subscribe or more. Peace out, guys.